Hi and welcome to this tip for Microsoft Excel. Here I'm going to show you how to um, or what the best way is to put a large amount of text into Excel. Oftentimes people just simply type into cells. Right? But you really can't do a lot of stuff in cells and as you notice it overlaps from A to B and though you can make it look better um, you know, if you take the grid lines off, you can make it appear like you're looking at a Word document, but it's really going to limit your functionality. So the best way that you can put text into Microsoft Excel is to go to the Insert tab. In the text box, select Text Box. Draw yourself a text box. Then go over to Microsoft Word. I have a sample paragraph here. Copy that and paste it in here. And there you have um, a paragraph of text that you can pretty much format, not entirely like it's in Word, but um, it has a lot of the functionality that Word would have, which is what you really don't get when you put text in a cell. If I didn't want to just copy and paste text in, I could create a text box and just start typing in it. Um, just type in it like you're in your word processor pretty much. And if you want to format anything, just right click in the text box and you can go to format text effects or the format shape, font, paragraph, so you can uh, change spacing, you can do a lot of things here. But I'm not going to get into really all the formatting options you can do right now. The point of this was really just to show you the best way to um, put a large amount of text into Excel. And now if you wanted a page with only text and nothing to do with all the cells in the background, you could go to the View tab and uncheck grid lines. And when I zoom out, so it's normal size, um, you can have a bunch of text just like this. So this is really the way that you should put a lot of text into Excel. And that's pretty much it for this tip. If you'd like to get the workbook, go to teachexcel.com and search for this video tutorial. And you can download it there. And that's it.